The Mequon native is still in the hospital after being shot in the leg. Our Todd Hicks spoke with him by phone today. Todd, good evening. Well, good evening, Tom. Uh, Carrie Rothman went to see The Dark Knight Rising with a buddy. Now, just 20 minutes into that film, the Wisconsin native told me he thought he'd never get out of that movie theater alive. On a cell phone from his hospital bed in Colorado, Kerry Rotman described in chilling detail the terrifying scene at the movie Massacre. We heard, uh, you know, a couple screams and then kind of realized that, that, you know, somebody's up front shooting at us. Rotman grew up in Mequon, but moved out to Colorado with his wife of just three weeks. The 27-year-old decided to take in the midnight showing of the movie with a friend in town. Little did he know that within minutes, both would be showered in a sea of bullets. I put my arm over my friend and was, you know, trying to cover uh, him and and get us, you know, as, as far down close to the ground and as covered as possible. Before the gunfire ended, a bullet hit Rotman in the leg and his friend in the arm. Luckily, I had enough adrenaline with my with my leg wound that I was able to, to run out of there. Rotman graduated from Homestead High School in 2003. He's seen here later while playing football at Winona State. He tells me even though he'll recover, he doesn't know if the terrifying scene will ever leave his mind. I don't think anybody can entirely erase something like that from their mind. And Rotman's friend did survive that shooting as well. Now, he was taken to another hospital and is expected to be okay. On your side, live in the news from Todd Hicks, today's TMJ4. And Todd, do we know how long it will take for Kerry Rotman to recover? Well, Tom, it's not going to be a quick recovery. Doctors told him today that recovery effort could take up to a year. But otherwise, while speaking with me, he was in good spirits. That is good to hear. Todd, thank you. And we are learning more about.